Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Love Edge and and today I'm back with another video for the Galaxy S3 i9D300 and we are going to install the Hexagon ROM version 2.4 on the Galaxy S3 i9D300 right over here and it is a lineage OS based ROM so it has some customization on top of it so it looks really really cool and before we get started i would just like to say if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you're new here please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to share the video so that we get to our goal of 1000 subscriber by a month i guess please do share the video and now let's get into it so first of all what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn off our device and now we're gonna go into the custom recovery and to do that we're just gonna press volume up key, home key and power key at the same time and now we're gonna load go of the power key and now we're gonna go in wipe and we're gonna go in advanced wipe and now we're gonna select Dalvik cache, cache, system and data and we're gonna swipe to wipe and now we're gonna go back, back and back and now we're gonna go in install and we're gonna select the hexagon rom version 2.4 and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash so the ROM is based on the Lineage OS 14.1 as far as I know but it has some black customization over it which makes it look so cool. So we're just gonna see how it really looks and I think it looks really cool. So now we're going to reboot the system and we're going to select the do not install because the ROM has already installed the matches. So guys this is a really cool boot of animation I think. So the device is booted up and as you can see you have the pixel like launcher over here and I think it has some kind of uh, blue light filter because the screen looks yellowish but uh, it there might not be and as you can see you have different icons over here for everything and you have a little different status bar and the settings over here and this is just something different that this ROM has so let's go into a bar device and as you can see that the Android version is 7.1.2 and you have the May 5 security patch so it is a little bit old and let's go out and let's check out if it has the Google assistant and it does not have that and you only have one launcher with this ROM this is the launcher and I really like this and you can drag applications to this bar over here which is from the pixel so I really like that as well so I think that's it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, please subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to share the video. And thanks for watching, guys.